Ngayon ay magsasagot naman tayo ng uh, calculus problem involving area given two functions. Dito sa problem number one, meron tayong function y equals e to the negative x squared at saka y equals 1 minus cosine x and the y-axis. At kailangan daw natin kunin yung area ng uh, um, function na ito doon sa loob nitong mga boundaries na to. So since ang function natin ay uh, hindi simple polynomial function, kakailanganin natin gumamit ng calculator sa pagkuha ng area between the curves. So gagamitin natin itong TI-84 para dito sa calculus problem na ito. So yung una natin gagawin is to plug in yung uh, function 1 and function 2. So in this case, y is e to the negative x. Second, e to the negative x squared. So yan yung function 1. Yung function 2 or equation 2 is 1 minus cosine x. Now kapag nag-graph natin siya, makikita natin yung uh, boundaries ng dalawang function. So since me medyo maliit yung graph natin, i-zoom in na lang natin siya kasi um, kukunin lang natin graph is yung graph in between the two function, yung red graph and blue graph, at saka yung y-axis. So, zoom 3 or 2. At mas makikita natin ngayon yung itsura ng ating function. So, yung naunang graph, yung blue graph, yung y equals e to the negative x squared, at yung nasa baba naman yung y minus 2 cosine x. So, kung translate natin siya sa ating illustration, So, ito yung area na kailangan nating kunin. So, sa pagkuha ng area na ito, kukunin, kukunin lang natin yung integration between the top and the bottom function from 0 up until the value of x dito sa point na ito. So, kailangan natin makuha yung boundary ng ating integral kasi sa pagkuha ng area between curves, kailangan natin yung area niya is between A and B ng top function minus bottom function. And in this case, since yung area natin is, ang boundary is from 0 to 1 along the x-axis, dx yung gagamitin natin. So, yung top function natin, Alam natin na yung blue function, to check it, so trace, yung blue function natin, nasa taas, ito yung ating y equals e to the negative x squared. At yung bottom, itong function na ito, ito naman yung 1 minus cosine x. At kailangan natin makuha yung boundary niya. So, using our calculator. So, second function, trace. Go to intersect para makuha natin yung intersection nito. At intersection niya ay 0.9419. So, rounding it up, yung value niya will be 0. 9, 4, 2. So, yan yung mga kailangan natin para makuha natin yung area nitong curve na ito. So, sa area, kukunin lang natin yung integral from 0 up until 0 0.942 ng top function, which is e to the negative x squared. minus 1 minus cosine x dx. So, using our calculator, so, alam natin yung function y sub 1 is yung nasa taas at yung nasa baba is yung 1 minus cosine x. 
So, using math 9 from 0 to 0.942, y sub 1 bars minus second function y sub 2 dx. So, ito ngayon yung area between the function. So, 0.591. So, yung area niya is equal to 0.591 unit squared. So, ganyan kasimple yung pagkuha ng area under the curve using TI-84. So, let's go ahead and answer problem number 2. So, so problem number 2, kailan natin makita yung function. So, y sub 1 natin is x cubed second plus 712 para ma-erase yung ating function. Um, parentheses, x cubed x to the third power divided by 1 plus x squared. So, ito yung function number 1. So, isulat natin siya. y sub 1 is x cubed 1 plus x squared. At yung y sub 2 natin sa calculator would be 4 minus 2x. 4 minus 2x. So, pag nag-graph natin siya, linear function ito at ito naman yung ating blue function. So, using our calculator, kukunin natin yung area bounded by the y-axis. So, ito yung area na yan. So, kung zoom in natin siya, so, trace natin siya. Zoom in. Yan yung y sub 1. At yun naman yung y sub 2. Ito yung ating y sub 1 at ito yung ating y sub 2. So, since alam na natin yung y sub 1 and y sub 2 bounded by the y-axis, so ito yung area na kailangan nating hanapin. So, from 0 up until the value of x dito, yun yung ating limit of integration from top to bottom. So, to set up our integration, yung integral niya would be a, b ng top minus bottom, dx. So, yung lower limit is 0. Kailangan natin yung upper limit. So, to find the upper limit, second function trace, go to intersect. So, kukumputin natin yung intersection ng red and blue graph. At yun ay 1.4876. So, let's write it as 1.488. So, ito yung ating upper limit. So, alam na natin upper and lower limit, yung ating y sub 1 and y sub 2, top minus bottom. So, pwede natin siyang isulat as y sub 1 minus y sub 2 with respect to x. So, using our calculator, math 9, 0, 1.488, vars, y vars is y sub 1 kasi yun yung top function natin. At yung, I'm sorry, yung top function natin is y sub 2. Kasi yun yung linear equation, bars, y bars, 2, at subtracted by 
yung y sub 1, which is 4 minus 2x, I mean, yung x cubed all over 1 plus x squared, dx. So, kailangan lang alam natin gamitin yung calculator para makuha natin yung area ng curve. I'm sorry, it's y sub 2 minus y sub 2. So, second function, entry, y2 vars y sub 1. 3.2145 so area niya is 3.215 unit squared so yan yung paggamit ng uh, calculator sa pagkuha ng area between curves